Hey you guys, welcome back to my uh, channel. So today I am going to do a simple video to start being back off on my channel. And the best video I could think of was brow. I have to get the back in the um, <clears throat> swing of things because like I do not know how to talk to a camera now. At this point, like I feel like I don't know. And it's so easy for me to talk to people, but this, this, this right here, it feels so awkward. I'm going to keep it pushing, okay? I just enrolled into an esthetician program and I'm ready to take myself serious. You get me? Serious. Yeah, we're here now. So, like I always had the passion. I always felt like I had the drive to do it. And I've really been, um, not taking myself serious. So we're gonna work on that. Well, I'm working on that for sure. And it starts here. Um, yeah, so let's write, like, just get into the video because, yeah, yeah. Okay, so before we get started, um, make sure you have your favorite eyebrow pencil or powder handy. I'm using, um, Nika K's, um, eyebrow pencil with a spoolie on the end. It's in the shade, uh, black brown. First, I start off by brushing my brows up so I can reveal the natural shape of them. Now, it's important to use a sharp eyebrow pencil. I cannot stress this enough. If you want those hair-like strokes, you're gonna need a sharp pencil. So make sure you keep that handy-dandy sharpener on the side. Like, if you want crisp brows, crisp brows, that's what you're gonna need. Grabbing a spoolie and blending it out. Going back in. And following where my hair grows. The pencil probably getting a little dull at this point, so I might need to sharpen it up again. Remember, the sharper the pencil, the better the strokes. And this movie helps out definitely too. And as you can see, I'm just following the way my hair grows. A little close up for you guys. Just fill it in. Now, if you made it this far, I just want to say appreciate you. I just want to say God is good all the time, all the time. He is good. And if you ain't know that, you get to know him. You get to know it. He has made a great path for me and is continuously showing up and showing out. He has never changed. Even when I strayed off, he has brought me right back. Love my God. So I'm just going in with a cream concealer. I believe this concealer is from Makeup Forever. Definitely a great brand, especially if you're starting off as a makeup artist. Um, you're supposed to go two shades lighter than your skin tone. I believe this is probably three, maybe four. But I like that blank canvas base above the lids. Like I like the brows to really be defined. So. Because, and then it helps with the um, eyeshadow too. Um, if I decide to put on eyeshadow, which I am later on, um, this will be my base. Again, you want to blend. And when I say blend, blend. Blend, 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 blend. That makes everything just look so natural. If you don't blend, it's going to look choppy. And notice I'm blending out the ends of it. I'm not blending towards the, my brow or and whatnot. I'm blending out the end of the concealer. Creates that ombre effect. Again, blending is key. Remember that. Now I'm going um, like a shade lighter then my natural shade, maybe two. And I'm just gonna shape, scope out my um, top brow. Like so. Honestly, the top of the brow is easier. Um, I know I suck at voiceovers, but like I'm a visual learner, so if you can see what I'm doing, like you will get it. And I'll just work on being able to communicate what I'm doing for you guys. 
this is me just showing you how sharp the brow is. It's very convenient when the sharpener is actually the lid to the pencil. So I'm just taking my foundation brush and I'm just really um, blending that out as well. So it just doesn't have any harsh lines. Like it, you can't tell where I just added concealer and whatnot. Again, um, oh, this is very important. Make sure you're like setting your brows. Like that will make it stay in place. Like my brows go nowhere when I set my brows. And you know, after you set, if it still looks, you know, you wipe away the powder, like just go in with a sharpened pencil like I showed you and just redefine the brows. Simple as that. Natural brows. Very aesthetic. Okay, I appreciate you guys' support. Thanks for tuning in. But thank you again for watching. I appreciate the support, like I said. And you guys have a wonderful and blessed blessed day. Because you deserve it, okay? And don't let anybody tell you otherwise. Don't let anybody take you out of character because we don't let that do that. We don't let people do that to us around here, okay? We don't.